way too small for a goldfish. I mean, that is the size of the box. That is the size of my hand. My hand's pretty big and it has long fingers. So, yeah, this aquarium is pretty small. And the aquarium is only three quarters of this of whole product. So, I'm going to open up. It comes in something like this. Yay, I got it in white because as you can see, my room is pretty white. Okay, I have a white chair and I got a white closet and white everything. But yeah, black wouldn't have been that bad either. And I just got stuff out. I have to say, it is tiny. You can only put max, maximum. I wouldn't even put a beta in here. It's way too small for a beta. I have to say, I will probably j be just putting one one or two male guppies in here, male fancy guppies in here, because um, it really is not big at all, and yeah. Um, I'm not sure about putting two male guppies together, I'm going to do more research about that before I get a proper fish for this tank. The care for the fish will be better. So, I definitely, I do want neon tetras, but then they do live in schools, and a school of five neon tetras for this whole tank is still pretty small. You have an adjustable lamp thingy yep it's really adjustable and it basically is LED lights they're already um, installed in but it's easy to find replacements you have a little like fake faucet which is like where the water comes out from from the filtration system so this is a fake plant it has fake roots and everything it's just green really like fluffy oh my plant broke well that's just so awesome so I'm probably going to put that as one of her down points because my plant did break. But uh, yeah, this is the underground filtration system. Basically, it's just like racks and you can see the filtration system right here. So yeah, the gravel covers that. So yeah, don't know. Oh, um, here's the gravel or rocks or whatever. I'm probably going to wash these out before I put them in. And these are probably going to hold my plant because my plant did break. This is a USB power connector thing, which powers a USB. And I'm going to be plugging this in. Probably not on my, onto my laptop because of the waste battery. I'm going to plug it into this, which is my iPhone charger, and it works. It tells you minimum amount of water. So I'm doing this my max. So minimum is right there, and maximum is over there. So I'm going to definitely fill it to the maximum because this tank is tiny. Um, there's... A screen here this is the tube as you can see where the water comes in through um, on the back there are a few switches the first one uh, this one is the USB thingy where you plug in the USB this is a motor so the filter which has on and off and the light which is this overhead LED light like that those like two dots over there there and there yeah those are two LED lights which change color which I'm actually not too happy about because I wouldn't like it if someone was shining like color torches into my house like 24 7 so I don't know about that so it comes with the tank installed LED lights it's pretty small this is the size of my hand inside the tank so yeah it's 1.5 liters only um pack of gravels and a fake plant sorry about the lack of videos recently but I'll post a, a cover video soon when I get the time probably on the weekend and it's Thursday night now so that'll be coming up soon thank you for watching bye so I am back and it's been a day and I've cycled my tank and I uh, got my fish already so yeah so um this is a setup tank um basically it's not powered by my usb right now it's powered by batteries i don't know how that works but it's powered by three aa batteries so um i got like pencils and pens and like scissors and stuff here and my, the usb connector is in here just in case i got a really pretty pen in here okay so the light is on right now there um because if I turn it away, it actually does make a difference. Like, you can see it does make a difference. And it does keep the tank warmer. Um, the filter is on and the LED lights are on. Which I'm actually not happy at all about the colored LED lights. But, what can I do? I set the time and everything. So, yeah, you have the time. Temperature, it's pretty cold out. So, I don't know how I'm going to install it heater okay now for the tank as you can see i've got two fancy tailed guppies in there um 
I don't, I'm not sure, but I think I'm going to change one of them, like swap them, but not sure about that. So basically I only got two male fancy tail guppies because this tank is definitely not big for anything else. Not big enough for anything else. And I actually was looking at other types of fish that I was going to put in there. It took me a while to decide on getting guppies. So you can see the fish at the back over there. Um, so everything's set up. It's been cycling for a while. I did take out some water because I know guppies are jumpy. So the water is all clean. It's not foggy or anything because I have been cycling it. Thank you for watching. Hope you liked the video. Uh, bye!